Hey everybody, Patrick from WP Builder Helper here again with another tutorial. Today we're going to talk about what to do when you want to kick someone off your website. Maybe it's an IP address that keeps bothering you or maybe it's a hacker or maybe it's a bot. It could be a number of different things. But let's say that you notice that there's an IP address that just continues to bother you and will not resist, you know, won't let up and it keeps trying to get in. So such is the case here. As you can see, I'm using WordFence. I'm sure it works with many of the other security programs too, but you need to be vigilant about this. If you notice that there is an IP address and it's constantly trying to hack into your website, then there's a good chance that eventually they'll make it in if you don't have some security protocol that's kind of installed to stop them making it much, much harder, such as a, a really, really strong password, using two-factor authentication, things like that. Using a security plugin is one way that you can stop this. And one of the uh, best security plugins that I really, really like, I haven't tried them all, but I'm, one day I'm going to get around to trying all of them, is WordFence. I really, really like WordFence. It's one of my favorites, and for the free version, it does a lot of what you need done. So in this case, we have a person who has been trying to get into this website right here and I'm going to blur out some of this information so don't be uh, too surprised if some of it gets blurred out because I just don't need anybody knowing everything but in this case we have this website right here th this uh, bot that keeps coming in and keeps trying to do code injects and things like this so I'm about to take and show you how you can do this with WordFence. It's very, very simple. The first thing you want to do is copy this IP address. I'm in the dashboard right now. Then once you go to WordFence, you want to go to Tools. And in Tools, you're going to be given a live traffic option, which will let you see some of this. Once again, I'm going to blur some of this out so that you can't see it. But you can see that there's a live traffic option here that shows some of the people who are coming in with IP addresses and who you know they're trying to log in and what they're doing and all that so you can come in here and you can just block them manually here or if you actually go to your firewall you can select blocking right here and if you select blocking you can literally just type in an IP address which is right here you give the IP address that you want to so I copied it and then you give a reason for blocking so in this case I'll just say hacking and I'll say block this IP address and boom that IP address is now blocked now one thing to note about this that I want you to keep in mind is that anybody who is aware of, of hackers knows that if you have a hacker that's using multiple IP addresses then this won't really work for you very well. But if you have a bot that is constantly hitting your site over and over again, then this works perfectly. So a hacker using multiple IP addresses, you're going to have to use some different method to try and block them. But if you just have if you just have one block bot and it's hitting your website over and over and over again with that same IP address, then this is a perfect solution. Anyway guys, this is just a quick tutorial. I hope that some of you have enjoyed this and I hope that you learned something from it. If you did, hit that like button and subscribe down below and I will see you guys next time.